Yo, what's up YouTube? Welcome to Game 7 in the Eastern Conference Finals where you have the Cleveland Cavaliers in Chicago against your Chicago Bulls. That's right, Derrick Rose is still with the Chicago Bulls and I'm excited to play with him even more now that he went to the Knicks in real life. And big, big Game 7 coming, up, coming off of Cleveland Cavaliers Game 5 and Game 6 victory. Bulls, Cavaliers, let's get this thing going. A starting five for both teams. As it's, they're the same as last game. Irving, Allen, Rush, Jones, Lopez, then our Rose, Butler, Tony Snell, Diamond Stone, and Pau Gasol. Let's get this one started here. We win the jump ball. Here's Derrick Rose on the first possession. Crossing over, going right to the hoop. Lays that one in right hand, and there's two points right away for Derrick Rose. Now here comes Cleveland's first basket. It's going to be another backdoor cut this time by Brandon Rush. You saw that a lot in Game 5. Need to make sure that doesn't happen. Here's a steal by Diamond Stone. He's going to kick this one out to Jimmy Butler. Open on the break. He throws that down two-handed, and we get the lead 4-3 to three right back. Here's Derrick Rose coming off the screen. A nice dish to Pau Gasol. Left-handed slam over Brooke Lopez. Up by three here early. Pass inside. Brooke Lopez gets an easy left handed layup there. Now here's Jimmy Butler. He's going to dish this one back out to Pau Gasol. Excellent release. And he missed it. Wow. He missed an excellent release. Now Ter Terrence Jones is going to make us pay on the other end with a mid range jumper. Now under five here in the first quarter. A low scoring game. And this was with Taj Gibson. He has the mid range jumper. He gets that one to go. Here's Derrick Rose coming off the screen with Taj Gibson. He sees an open Avery Bradley in the corner for three. That is good. Avery Bradley knocks down a big time three. Now here's Derrick Rose on the break again. Good ball, move ball movement here. Going to kick it back out to Taj Gibson for the mid range jumper. That is good. Here's another screen and pop here. There's Maritich for three. He gets that one to go. Love shooting ten times better with Maritich than I do. Pa Pau Gasol. But look at this left handed layup by Jarrett Jack. And just contested and everything but he still knocked it down here's Taj Gibson another mid-range jumper another mid-range jumper to go that's three in a row for Taj Gibson now up by four back cut Jared Jack and one caught me sleeping on defense there D Rose and he's going to convert that free throw and make this a one point game here now down by one later here's Derrick Rose going to pull up for three Della Vadova is getting back lazily on defense and we get that three and we go to the end of the first quarter up 24 to 22 in this game seven trying to make it to the NBA final Finals with the Chicago Cubs here Chicago Cubs who what Chicago Bulls sorry if you have seen my Dodgers franchise you'll know that we're playing the Chicago Cubs in uh, uh, the NLDS so if you have not checked out that series make sure you do so there's Pau Gasol with an AM1 he missed the free throw though we're up by three here's a dish inside to Brandon Rush he's gonna lay that one in before Diamond Stone can he come block that one now here's a nice quick fast break dish up the court to Pau Gasol he gets the two-handed slam now here on the break here's Jimmy Butler dish it over the eight Avery Bradley, one-handed slam all over Terrence Jones. And here's going to be an and one by Pau Gasol. The momentum is changing. He misses the free throw once again. Up by five. Here's Jared Jack in the short corner. He's going to get that mid-range to go. Gets it back to within three. Here's Derrick Rose on the pick and roll. He sits an open man on the left side. It's McDermott. Excellent release. Bang. Doug McDermott doesn't miss those ones. Up by seven. Del Vadova. He's going to spin. He's going to go to the hoop. A nice floater. A beautiful move by Del Vadova. He gets it to go. We're up by five. Derrick Rose is going to do some weird th dribble through the ref, but he's going to dish it over to Jimmy Butler, who throws that one down two-handed. Here, Taj Gibson in the post, having a great day so far. He's going to get the and one. And one, Taj Gibson. He would convert the free throw, unlike Pau Gasol can. Up by eight now. Here's Jared Jack at the top of the key, getting the screen from Brooke Lopez. He's going to dish this one to Brooke Lopez. Fading jumper. He gets it to go. Makes it a six-point game. On the other end, Derrick Rose dish out to Jimmy Butler. Mid-range jumper is good. He gives us the six-point lead. Heading in the halftime, 49 to 40. Three really need to start converting at the free throw line. Maybe mainly Pau Gasol. He has not been shooting very well from the free throw line this game. Field goal percentage is good. Assist is pretty good as well. We're hitting some threes there as they are 0 for 6. That's pretty costly, but we need to continue this to win game 7 in the second half. Big second half, trying to make it to the NBA Finals. Let's get this thing going. Here's a dish inside the Kyrie Irving. Fadeaway jumper. Nice quick move. He misses it, but there's Brooke Lopez on the offensive glass. Lays it in. First two points of the second half. Here's a Derrick Rose spin move. Dish it in the Pau Gasol. Out to Tony Snell. Tony Snell gets our first two points of the second half. Now up by four. Here's Tony Allen and one. Jimmy Butler couldn't contest that one as well as I would have liked, but Tony Allen's going to go to the free throw line and convert from there to a one-point game. Now here we're going to catch him sleeping on an inbounds play. Avery Bradley just so Stood under the basket, caught that one and laid it in. Ridiculous play, but here's Kyrie, spin move, pulled up jumper. How are you going to defend that? That is just, you can't defend that. Now, up by one. Here's Kyrie again, behind the back on Tony Snell. He's going to drive to the basket, left-hand layup, and he's getting hot. You know from last year's playoffs um, in this uh, franchise that... 
he got hot against us last year, and he really made us pay and scored 30-plus to give them the victory while LeBron was fouled out. But here's Brooke Lopez. He's making us pay this whole entire series. He gets a mid-range jumper. Here's Todd Gibson getting the pass. A nice ball movement to McDermott in the corner. A-plus release. That is good, and we are back up by two. Now here's Jared Jack fading away. No, he's going to diss this one. The Brooke Lopez deep jumper. He gets it to go. He's killing us with that mid-range game. Here's Jimmy Butler on the break, though. And one, Jimmy Butler. He's going to take that strong. The hoop. Mo Williams had no chance there and the free throw is good we take the two-point lead here's Mo Williams for three he's gonna not be able to make that and it's gonna be dished up to Jimmy Butler on the break with one point there's no time left actually he got that one off with like 0.2 seconds left and we are lucky to get that one off Jimmy Butler ridiculous left-handed layup I'm glad he made it but probably I don't know that's not very realistic but nonetheless I'm just looking for a victory not realism there's a layup by Tarek Rose now here's a floater swatted by Kyrie or Kyrie's floater is swatted. We just went all the way up to Jimmy Butler for the easy two-handed slam and we take the lead. Up by 10 now. Avery Bradley. Good ball movement. Leads to a Derrick Rose layup. We are just pulling away at this one. Up by 12. There's a dish to Derrick Rose. 4-3. That one is money. Give me all three of those. Up by 13 now. Five minutes left in the fourth. We're pulling this one away. They're going to have to try to make a run. Der Terrence Jones is going to try to do They had that game winner last game, you know. That really just broke our hearts. But nonetheless, Diamond Stone. Two-handed flush on a nice pass by Jimmy Butler. Derrick Rowe is going to try to make something happen. He's going to dish it to Jimmy Butler. Just bumps into the man before slamming that one down with the two-handed flush. Now here they are with the last play of the game. Brandon Rush gets an and one. And they are going to make it a seven-point game, a six-point game after he converts a free throw. And But that would be all but over with four seconds left. But wait for this. We're going to give this one up to Avery Bradley who's going to dish it up to Taj Gibson who throws that one down. One-handed exclamation mark. We are going to the NBA Finals. The Eastern Conference champions. The Chicago Chicago Bulls run away with that one in the fourth quarter. That creepy look from Diamond Stone. Don't know what that was, but nonetheless, we get the victory and we are going to the NBA Finals. Derrick Rose, Jimmy Butler lead us there. Eastern Conference champions, Chicago Bulls. What a victory. And now you will see who we are playing here in a second. That was us last year, all sad and stuff, coming back to the locker room and getting beat by the Cleveland Cavaliers. But this time on our home court, we come away with the victory and one one that I am so glad we got to make it back to the NBA Finals with the Chicago Bulls. See us lifting up the trophy and everything. Jimmy Butler, our star player, doing so. But who will we be playing in the NBA Finals? Yeah, you probably could have guessed it. The Golden State Warriors come back for that NBA Finals series against the Warriors.